Okay, so I am back again. Um, I went shopping. <laughs> again, apparently that's all I do. Um, when my mom went to a shoe store, which I have to admit, as for being crowded, was pretty awesome. Um, the shoe store is called Wholesale... Wholesale fashion shoes, I think, something like that. I'll put the link below. I don't know if they're all over or if they're just out here, um, here in Arizona. So, they are, their thing is, all their shoes are ten dollars and eighty eight cents, and then you get the boots or more, and then they've got bat handbags and stuff like that. So I went and got, knit up with four pairs of shoes from there. We'll show them here real quickly. I am not a heel person. I'm a tennis shoes jeans, flats, sandals, so this isn't much of a heel, but got this one here, the wedge, and just stretchy across here, they're actually super comfortable, stop spinning it there so you guys can actually see it, the brand is forever, I've never heard of them as a brand, um, so, there's this pair, black, and you'll notice most of mine are black. I get black, white, gray, maybe a tan every now and then pair of shoes. I'm not crazy colors with my shoes. I sit up and I have a lot of pink hair, so <laughs> they're on the edge of my bed here. So, that's this one, which is brand L and C. Again, never heard of them. Have this little kind of Ed Hardy-ish logo, just says, New York City, so, super shiny, um, figured, I need shoes for work, I've got tennis shoes, that's all I wear, trying to be a little less tennis shoey, I have a lovely sunburn across here, so it looks really funky on the camera, I had to point that out, it's bothering me, looking at my webcam here, so I got this mixed pair by Janice. That's the brand there. And they're just little black and white ballet flats that can be laced up. So, nothing too crazy with those ones either. So like I said, all three, all four of these pairs of shoes I bought ten dollars and eighty eight cents. As much as it was crowded and completely sucked there, it was okay for that reason. Then this one is by Blossom Collection. Um, the other two lids are a little messed up, but I didn't show them. And there's these ones, which are also ballet flat. They are a darker pink with a little bit of a lighter pink elastic strappy. So that is them. They totally blend into my shirt there. So those are the shoes that I got there. Um, while we're doing shoes, we'll go over to, went over to Ross, picked up some clothes. Um, a sign for work that I didn't, it's actually in the car already to take to work tomorrow. It says, good morning, let the stress begin. Thought that was totally perfect for my desk, my department at work. Um, also at Ross, I, I did pick up another pair of shoes. These ones have some serious weight behind them. Again, they're, they're, these ones are heels, which is a little less, is a little different for me. Um, they got the, they got the wedge here. Let's see if I can get the color here so that's the heel they're a black kind of black black blade across here they're not too bad nice big heel which i don't do the stilettos i am not coordinated enough in flat tennis shoes come on now so that's them here these ones are by calvin klein i don't know if i said that here calvin klein um they're actually pretty comfortable when i tried them on they were you know strapped together in the front kind of hop out of the way if I can hop in a store, we're good to go. So that was that. Also at Ross, picked up a crown. <laughs> well, metal, or uh, what is it? Metal with jewel crown. Thank you. Such a history person that I, I love this. So this is going to be, once I figure out how I'm going to redo my room. I probably have said that every time now since I started filming. But I'm going to redo my room, and this is going to be one of the things. I think I'm going to use this, and I got the some wrought irony keys, different size keys. I love keys also, so I'm going to redo my room. 
history ish history freak, so I loved that when I saw that. And now into the clothing. This is nothing too exciting. Just a pair of bike shorts. Black bike shorts for I got some little summer dresses. And because they're a little bit too short, I like to wear bike shorts underneath them. I surprisingly cannot find bike shorts to save my life. Then I got a pair of white capris. So work. Um, I'm not too crazy in love with white pants, but I need pants for work really bad. I'm, and I'm tired of wearing pants. So I'm like trying to mix in some other stuff into my wardrobe. I don't usually like capris because I am shorter. They don't they usually hit around the middle of my ankle, which is kind of frustratingly irritating. Then I picked up this shirt here. Yeah, that's where I get you guys some money here. It is got a little bit of design here. A little design here. It's it is a little bit secret, so obviously I'm gonna have to wear the same top underneath it. Um if I can get the design. This is the design that it has down the front of it as well. Um it's long sleeves, so the sleeves are simple enough I can just kinda push up and get out of the way. And then Apparently that was all I bought today at Ross. And then I bought a purse. I like the big oversized purse. It's black and white with pink and green butterflies. Nice and big. I'm going to put that out here shortly. Um, yesterday, <laughs> I went to Ross also with one of the girls from work. Um, picked up this shirt here. This is black. Simple. Has this little, this little, very simple metal ring here on the front. But it's very simple and I like it. It's just very simple and looks cute. How many times can I say simple in that little sentence like there? I'm gonna pick up this one here. It's a black and white striped short sleeve shirt. All very thin. The sweater was a little bit thicker, obviously. Easy, I can wear to work, and no fuss. I am not a fussy person with clothing. Most of the time, I don't even wear makeup to work. You're lucky I get out of bed. Picked up this one here, which is kind of gray and purple, with some black. A little more, a little more girly here. It is a little lacy-ish. Here, has the stretch band on the bottom, which I think three, the last three shirts I showed had that on the bottom. And I picked up a dress. It's nothing more to run around the house in. Um, I can wear it to work, but I have to wear a shirt, jacket, sleeve thing over it here. It's a simple summer, neat summer dress, kind of not cinches, but um, kind of a little bit of a band across the waist, and just different shades of green. So that was Ross for the last two days, um, and then I also we ran over to Target. Um, I surprisingly didn't buy any makeup, and this is, I think, the last of my things. They had the men's t-shirts on sale. They were three for fifteen dollars. So, I'm like, I need any more t-shirts. Talk about needing to go girlier, and I buy three t-shirts. So, it's all good. I, you know, run around the house and I'm most of the time or I sleep in them. So, the first one is this one here. He looks like one of the Sesame Street guys. It's not a luxury gift. I kept saying his name wrong earlier. So, there's this one. And then, pick up this one. This, this, this is the bear in California. Kind of like, kind of history y to me. I think, I'm pretty sure I've seen that in a history book before. That's my California shout out there. And I think this has to be my favorite one of all. Cause my mom always, my mom is always laughing at me about Facebook. So. And when she thought, she totally thought of me. How do I block you in real life? Like, if I could tell people that, I probably would. 
I'm the mean one that has blocked my help not accepting my aunt on Facebook and she's not happy about it. So that's my haul from the, from today and yesterday. Um that's what we decided to do, so um I know I haven't posted anything lately. Um give me ideas for what I should post next. I know I do a lot of hauls because I don't know what else to do. Um if I have some ideas, post them if you want to see something. I can figure something out um, from that. Um, I know I was thinking about doing some baseball posts during the during the spring training. I didn't get to go out to very many. Um, I might try to because my ex is back in town and we're kind of talking again. Do some photography. Hopefully, I can get some more of that in, and those might be more bloggy than this because I don't know how <laughs> to do that, but. Um, any comments, questions, concerns, leave them below. Let me know what's going on. Do you have any ideas of what you want to see? Or any, just something for me to come up with. Um, any ideas. I'm bad at coming up with ideas. So let me know. Thanks for watching and I'll talk to you guys later.